Hi, I'm Chris Smart with Just Dots. Right now I'm checking out some eggs from a cow goat to a high gold female I purchased that came straight out of Africa. Um, these eggs are due to hatch today's July 4th, they're due to hatch on the uh, 17th. Um, as you can see, they're starting to concave a little bit and they're getting very soft. Um, from my understanding, what happens is the uh, uh, pores in the eggs start to expand, causing the eggs to get a lot softer and actually it makes it a lot easier for the babies to pip out. Um, all these eggs are looking great. I'm really looking forward to seeing this clutch come out. Um, I also did get uh, last week a, uh, a clutch of genetic stripes uh, head to head. Those hatched out. Um, what I'll do is I'll pull those out so you can see those. One is just shed and the other one is about to shed. couple of the babies that hatched out last week. Like I say, they, uh, they started to shed. This box has one of the males. Actually, this is one of the males that uh, these are 66% uh, head um, for genetic stripe since the parents were uh, both head for stripe. Here's the um, this guy was shed the next day. His eyes just started to clear up. Um, they were actually really dark this morning. Uh, this is a male, and I'm assuming by tomorrow morning he'll probably be shed. But that nice looking male. And then, actually, the one that did shed is right here. And this guy is another male. He hasn't eaten yet. Um, hopefully, probably in the next uh, couple of days or a week or so, he'll uh, he'll take his first meal. But um, beautiful little guy, not a full stripe. Got a couple of breaks in the back here, um, but nonetheless, uh, he's a nice looking male. I will keep one of these as a breeder. Um, not sure which one yet. That's what I got so far. So far it's been a slow year. I got most of my stuff still coming up. A lot of calico combinations. Um, so you'll be seeing those shortly down the road.